Well, uh, I have been uh, listening to the arguments, debates, uh, in connection with the Pradyum and murder case and the recent development. I have only one question and that's very obvious. <clears throat> Who is going to take the responsibility of what the police did to Ashok? And it's very much clear that why the Haryana police did what they did to Ashok and how they got the uh, <clears throat> they made him accept his uh, crime so called uh, it's high time now that something should be done against these type of uh, modus operandi of the police. I'm using modus operandi deliberately. Today CBI says that Ashok was not guilty. This 16 year old boy is guilty. A few days ago, everybody was framing Ashok. Everybody, including we, the media. We jumped to the conclusion almost immediately the day it happened. And I, I have no hesitation in accepting that I was also one of them who initially uh, thought that it was the driver of the cleaner because the uh, as the scene of crime happens so first of all we the so-called fourth estate should and must start analyzing before jumping to a conclusion in earlier days a journalist used to be responsible for their copy used to be responsible not to the editor or the newspaper, to the people. Those days are gone. Now, if you do a mistake or omission, you either give a corrigendum, sometimes we don't even do that. Those days are gone and uh, it's a very common saying that a journalist is supposed to give the information he is not responsible. A bullshit. A journalist should be and must be responsible for his reportage. That's a separate issue. In this case, the police, senior police officials should face the music because what they did to Ashok is not only inhuman but brutal they had applied extreme third degree and I was listening to one of the report on one of the channels where they said that they had hit him below his uh, feet and even uh, put him in cold water, the very regular styles of police interrogation. So if this boy had done this crime, then Ashok naturally is innocent, but every I mean, everything was done to frame him till day before yesterday. It's high time. The structure should be changed and judiciary should step in.
to uh, to do something in this. It it hurts, it pains, and finally, uh, what compelled me to talk to you guys is. I was thinking that what was what the family had been through a man from a, 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 a poor guy a sole bread, bread earner a, just imagine what his family must have gone through living in village charge of sodomy and murder of a second standard boy. Haryana police cannot go scot-free and just shrug off its shoulders. It's high time. They should face the music and they should be brought to books the responsible cops.